Hi all, Skids Tweak here. I wanted to take a moment, make a quick film about a new product we're working on here at Skids Parts. It's called Gridiverse. And it's more than just a regular product. It's uh, an entire website. It incorporates some of the latest technologies for the Second Life client and uses a lot of Ajax, so it's very zippy. Right now, one of the only features we have is a favorites organization, so I'm going to be demonstrating that today. And you can get that at any of the stores. Here's what you get, this little HUD button. You just wear it, and this is totally free. When you click it, you get a prompt to open up a web page inside Second Life, and if you don't like using that prompt, you can actually see it spits it out to the owner only. You can copy and paste that into a web browser or click it in your local window, and it'll open up. And here it is. This is uh, Gridiverse. You can drag and the maps around, and you can zoom in and out. Uh, here's a note on a regular web browser, the scroll bar or the scroll wheel will actually work, but not inside Second Life for some reason. And uh, over here to the left is the Favorites tab. Uh, when you click that, it opens up. In a regular web browser, again, it's much more faster. But uh, this is inside Second Life. So it's very convenient. You can always click that Open in Web Browser button right there to move it over to your web browser. And here's a list of folders. When I click on one of the folders, you can see a list of my favorites. Right now, you can't nest the folders, but we do have plans for that in the future. So you'll be able to have several folders deep. To create a folder is pretty simple. At the top here is this text box. I just type it in. I press enter and looky there. There it is. Of course, since we just created it, it doesn't have any favorites under it yet. So let's go ahead and add this spot where I am right now uh, to it. I click the pen and I get this little pop-up window and I click add favorites and I get this prompt here to the left above my favorites. I'm able to change any of the values. I'm going to increase the Z location. And I am going to name it Coffee Shop. And click, and I'll select a folder where I want to put it. We're going to put it in the new folder. And I click Add, and looky there, there it is. Now let's take advantage of some of these favorites. I'm going to show you how to use them. You open up folder, and this is all my store locations. I'm going to select this one here. It pops up the location on the map and the pin. I click the pin, I click the link, and boom, there's the landmark. I click teleport, and I am there. Pretty simple. Now I'm going to take time quickly and show you some of the other features of the Gridiverse map that I think are really valuable. Uh, let's open it up and zoom out. As we zoom out, you can see I've actually recorded every single sim there is in Second Life, all 24,000 of them, except for the ones that are private and they won't let me on their sim. Now there's two ways to zoom in. You can use this button here or if you come over and you double click you actually zoom in uh, once you're down all the way down to the very bottom level if you double click you actually create a pin where you could add a favorite and such you can see from the higher levels I actually draw out the roads so you can see where they're at and if you zoom in all the way you can actually see I draw the parcel lines for every single parcel in Second Life on the bottom left hand side you'll see the sim name and then on the bottom right hand side you'll see the copyright for Gridiverse. I am going to fade that out so it's not so prominent and uh, it will look better in the future I promise. Over here on the left you can use these buttons to assist you in navigation just uh, pan into the right, left, top, bottom and uh, right here on the right hand bottom is a mini map and you can actually drag that little square in there to any spot and it'll go there oh one last thing I want to show you real quick how to delete a favorite in a folder 
I'm going to open up the folder, and you can see on the right-hand side there, there's this X. It's kind of hard to see it maybe in the movie. Click it, and it prompts you, do you want to delete it? Just click yes, and boom, it's gone. And that is it. I want to thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And uh, any feedback would be appreciated. If you got any questions, feel free to IM Skids Tweak. And uh, you can find the Grid Reverse Math button at all my stores and on SL Exchange. Just search Grid Reverse. Uh, thank you very much. Talk to you soon. See you later. Or whatever. Bye, guys.